Hey, we're at the Kimber booth. We had an opportunity at uh, range day to shoot the K6S, uh, which is the new revolver, brand new product offering from Kimber, as those of you who are familiar with Kimber products know. And we're here with Ryan, who's the VP of sales. Uh, first thing he said is he liked my shirt. National Sarcasm Society, like we need your support. And we come to find out we're kind of brethren in uh, that type of humor. So anyway, we're here to talk about the gun. So uh, Ryan, if you could take us through uh, I mean, shooting it, I was really impressed. I Thank mean, you. It, it's very lightweight. Uh, it was easy to shoot. It's got some snap. It's a 357 Magnum, so you expect it to. But what can you tell us about it? Then? Well, all, all sarcasm aside, um, we've been working on this for three years, and. Our basic goal at Kimber is, if you if you just close your eyes and point at one of our products, we want you to say that that's the finest product in that category, and that's exactly what we're trying to do with this revolver. So, I'll start from the ground up. We've got a six-shot cylinder. That's the smallest six-shot cylinder ever in 357 ever made, and it's almost as small as everybody else's five-shot cylinders. You see here that the chambers are recessed, yeah. and that's a custom shop feature often done on revolvers of very high end, you know, several thousand dollar revolvers. Yeah, back in the day it was done all the time, but it went away. A went long away, time and, and the reason it went away is because ease of manufacture and yep. sloppy manufacture, you want as much play as you can. Well, we're trying to get a, we're trying to get around all of that slop. Yeah. We want it to be very tight. You look how, look how tight this closes. Look at the cylinder to frame fit. There is no slop there. Um, so, small cylinder, 357, um, recessed chambers, all the controls very crisp, just like you'd expect on a Kimber. Everything melted. It's all stainless steel, removable dovetail sights, another long ago uh, standard feature. Now it's a custom feature. Right. One of the most beautiful things about this gun, no stack, eight pound trigger. So that trigger, eight pounds all the way through. Many triggers on revolvers, as you graph them, they're six or seven, eight, 13, 14, then yep. they drop. You feel yep. a big, and that's why people shoot them inaccurately. Right. This thing, steady all the way through. Brakes crisp, same place every time. Also, you noted the recoil impulse. Yep. The bore to hand to grip uh, ratio is very low, so the bore sets lower as opposed right. to our hand to everybody else's. That means recoil comes back like this, this way. instead of like this. Yep. So yep. very accurate to shoot. Um, all in all, what, what we hope is the finest production revolver on the market today. Um, finished in you know standard Kimber terms, rounded. Beautifully oh, it's, polished. It's beautiful. So. Yeah, I mean, it really is a gorgeous gun. What um, What's the weight, the total weight on this? 23 ounces. It's all okay. stainless steel. Yeah, 23 ounces. Very, very light. Uh, very controllable. It is a very nice grip. I've got medium sized hands, um, and I have no issue with this whatsoever. Uh, it is an internal hammer. It is an internal hammer. And shrouded so, internal hammer. Yeah, so a shrouded internal hammer. So, again, you're not going to have to worry about snags or anything when you're holstering it. Um, the fit and finish, as uh, Ryan said, is impeccable, which is what you expect from Kimber. Uh, the lockup is very tight. Everything works the way that you would expect it to. And uh, I was very, very impressed with how this shot. Um, what is the availability on this now? We will have these shipping sometime first, second week of May. They'll be shipping to our retailer network across okay. the country. Okay, so mid-year, yep. uh, they'll become available. Yep. And what is the MSRP that you're asking for this? $899. Okay, all right. Uh, I will say I've shot a lot of small frame revolvers and I've shot a lot of small frame 357s and I was very impressed with how this gun shot. To your point, the trigger makes a huge difference, especially in a gun this size. Yep. And it did, it mattered. It was a very smooth pull all the way through and I had no issue staying on target with you. Great. So, hey, I uh, appreciate your time. It's the best Kimber revolver you've ever shot. It is. That's fantastic, I hadn't my thought friend. of that. Yeah, good job. All right, thanks so much. Okay, thanks.